Hi and welcome to this Novell Zenworks video. We're going to take a look at the new auditing capabilities of Zenworks 11 SP3. With the auditing capabilities that have been introduced in Zenworks 11 SP3, you can now log changes made in ZCC, the Zenworks Control Center, and important events on managed devices when they occur. Additionally, you can view a report against this collected information in both the Zenworks Control Center and in Zenworks Reporting Server. Now, the benefits of this are that you can easily track what changed in the system, who changed it, when did it change, and additionally you can choose to be proactively notified when critical events, or for that matter any events, occur in your system. Let's go ahead and take a look at how this works. So what I have here is the Zenworks Control Center, and I'm on the configuration page, and you'll see here there's a new section called Audit Management. When you first install the product, Audit management is not enabled, so under event configuration, you have the ability to quickly and easily select the events that you cho choose to know about. So if I click add here, I can see a categorized list of the things that might be interesting to me. Uh, let's say I would just want to track what's happening with the bundles. That's all of your applications. You can also determine the criticality of these particular events for you. So in your case, maybe these are major events. You can select a number of days to keep things in the system. And you can also send log messages via email, SNMP traps, or the UDP forwarder. This allows you to be proactively notified when these type of changes occur. When I say OK, those are now active. And as changes are made in the system, they'll be automatically logged and possibly generate those notifications. I can also go to the Agent Events tab, and I can select certain things to be audited there as well. Uh, you'll see some of the things I can audit around remote management, things like files being transferred off the machine, remote control occurring, uh, remote view, so on and so forth. And then also under Endpoint Security Management, you have the ability to log when files are copied from the machine onto removable media. Once this is turned on, the agents in the Zen Control Center are going to begin logging those events. To see those events, you can either go to the dashboard, which will give you the system-wide view of those events. Uh, we'll go ahead and show as much as I can here. So we'll switch this back to November. And here you'll see all of the events that have occurred in my system since October. Relatively few critical events, a lot of majors, some informational. You'll see the top events that have occurred in the system and you can drill down to those. If you just want to go browse for those, you can also do that here. You can see every time a ZCC user has logged in, who that user is. Uh, you can see when a bundle was modified. You can see in this case, uh, sandbox version was a new sandbox version was created. Uh, in the case of a bundle change, you actually can get down to the individual pieces of the bundle that changed. In this case, it went from nothing to having a system requirement. On the agent side, you can see things like when authentic authentication failed. You can see that files have been copied to removable media. You can then use Zenworks reporting to get additional details. In addition to using the events view at the entire zone level, each object now has an events tab as well. So if you want to look at the audit for that particular object, simply go to the object, click on the events tab, and you can see all of the things that have happened with this particular device and what it happened for. So you can see it was assigned here, uh, it was modified, it was created, so on and so forth. So using Zenworks auditing, you now have the ability to easily collect data about who's ch making changes, when those changes are occurring, and what changes those are, as well as other important security events that may happen on the managed device. With that, this is Jason Blackett, the Zen Guru, signing off until next time.